again. I'm putting chocolate in my mouth before I hit record. This needs to stop. So, I do believe that it was Kate from Willoughby and Rose who suggested our next Gunny Sax theme because we've done uh, Saxween, we've done Saxmas. Gunny Snacks is our next theme. So, everyone is like getting food related items. I went into this fully believing that I would do like some sort of pastry thing because, you know, my cupcake witch was just adorable. Why not have that vibe in an everyday garment? We might still do that further down the lane as a future project, but for right now, we're doing strawberries. <laughs> Mostly because when I went to the fabric store, I saw this and I fell in love. And then I found the complimentary fabric and I fell even more in love. So I'm gonna be using the same pattern um, as I did for my Saxmas dress, which is the Gingy pattern. If the pattern is available, it'll be in the pattern shop down below. That's if my anxiety will let me release this pattern. It is such a technical build and I'm having such a hard time with it. Anyway. Also, yes, my hair is orange. I was over the blonde and I think this might stick for a while. I, I really like this color. It's fun. My book is also A Court of Thorns and Roses. It's a reread. I love this series. This pattern has seen better days. Yeah. So I'm thinking I want the, like the underside of the collar to be the accent fabric. Um, but I do want this strawberry to be like the majority of everything. And then like the pink be like all the details. Cause that's what I have in my head. I don't know what's going on. Turn on my book. Even though I don't want to listen to my audiobook, I just want to read my physical book because it came in last night and I'm waiting to read this book. And it's just so good. Okay, thought. When I do this photo shoot, what if I do it with like angel food cake and strawberries? Like, is that a thing? I mean, obviously it's a thing and I can do it because it's like my creativity. I don't know, I'm thinking about it. I don't know, what do you guys think? I'm missing a pattern piece. Found it! Somehow I think it's like a Mario theme from like those days when I like excessively played Mario Kart. Okay, good morning. I have everything cut out, so now I just need to sew it together. I think I want to start with the skirt, which just means lots of gathering, but if I get the tension right on my treadle, then it'll gather it for me while I sew everything. First steps first, I need to sew all of the tiers together, and then I need to add all of the accents and then we can start on the gathering and piecing it together. So that's where we're gonna start. I don't think I'm gonna finish the skirt today, but we should be able to get a good healthy start. I hate this skirt. It's pretty when it's done. It's so awesome, but I hate it.
So, I am on day three of a continuous headache. I've set very small goals for my days this week. Very, very small goals. And so as soon as I complete that goal, I literally go lay down and just rest the rest of the day. Let's get back to sewing. I know it's nothing new, but it's so good to see you. We do this every day, and I'm still so amazed by you. I made the collar. I'm trying to convince myself that that is not enough work to be done for the day. I mean, I also did the shoulder seams. I don't know if you guys can, if that's in frame, but I did the shoulder seams. But I'm trying to convince myself that is not enough work done today, even though all I want to do is crash. So I might go knit on the couch for a while and then come back later, maybe after a nap. I ever take a nap and it just doesn't help anything. So I have about an hour and a half left on this audiobook and I'm gonna work for that hour and a half and then I will be done. You know I'm here to stay every single day. seams and then attach the skirt to the bodice then we're ready for the final applique like the final assembly which honestly isn't a bad place to stop My fatal error in making this dress is that I now need to put darts in the front and the back to get it to be semi fitted because the button up pattern is not supposed to be fitted. I am feeling much better today. It seems like a three day slump and then feeling better on the fourth day is just the norm. I'm not going to completely finish this dress today because I don't have a machine that can do buttons and buttonholes but um, I want to get it to that point today. I put the darts in and they look really good. So now I'm going to attach the skirt and then we'll do the front button placket and then the collar and attach the sleeves. Um, and then I need to do some work on the hem of the skirt and then we're done. things I need to fix. So this needs to get raised up basically from here to where I have it pinned. The waistline needs to come up but also like look how this dips like so badly. I think it's more noticeable. Yeah more noticeable on this side. It's terrible. So I need to like fix this. 
but you can also see like the front is higher than the back which for my sway back is not good at all so I need to figure this out I did not finish the dress yesterday. I am still too super tired, but maybe we'll finish today. I need to find socks for my toes, so that way they stay warm. I need to get some water. Maybe get some caffeine in me. That might help. Someone want to do all the buttons and buttonholes for me because uh, that's all we got left. <laughs> um, I did put the, make the underside of the collar pink because I thought that would go with the front button placket really nice and give it a cute little like fun detail. But I do, I think I like this one better than Gingy if I'm being honest. Um, I do, next time I go to the fabric store, I am going to look for some more strawberries so I can add another tier so that way it's a little bit longer. Um, cause if you guys have been around for a while, you know I'm very particular about how things fit and the length of skirts and things. Um, and I would just like it like one tier longer. Okay, so I got the buttons and buttonholes done and I went out on a photo shoot. I am absolutely obsessed with how this dress turned out. Um, let's show you the word footage. Like I said in the beginning, if I can get my act together, the pattern for this dress will be down below. It'll have two views, which will be Gingy with the long sleeves and then the strawberry with the short sleeves. I, like, like I said, I'm absolutely obsessed with this dress. I think it is super cute. I might make more in the future if I can find fabric for a decent price because this takes a lot of yardage. Anyway, I will see you guys next time. Bye friends.